I was born with a strange gift. The ability to see what no human being has ever seen before. It's all mixed up in my head. The images, the sounds, the smell. I need to remember. Put things in order right up to this moment. Remember who I am. If I had to say how it all began, I might just as well start here. I found you by the side of the road in the middle of nowhere. Was there an accident? Did, did someone try to hurt you? How about a name? Someone I could contact? You must have family, friends, someone who could tell me who you are. Hey. You don't talk much, do you? Well, if you don't help me, I can't help you. Is that a scar? Is that a reason? To... Got to stop them. They have no idea what they're up against. Tell them to wait until I get there. Get back to them immediately, you hear me? You've got to stop them. Goddamn fools. How you doing today, Jody? Good? 
<laughs> I hate to bother you when you're playing and all, but uh, I believe it's time, honey. Girl, you'll have plenty of time to play later. All right, Nathan's waiting for us. Mm -hmm. Come on. I don't have any more chance. Hi, Cole. Seriously? Hey, Alan. It's nearly ready. It was due two weeks ago. Hello, precious. Don't you look ready. pretty today? Better late than never, I guess. It's gonna rain this weekend. We got a lot of rain this year. I suppose that's true. It hasn't been particularly cold, though. No, I haven't. Here we are. Hey, Jody. How's your day been so far? Pretty good. Okay, we're gonna put this on now. Remember? It's just like a crown. Oh, yeah. Oh, now you're a little princess. <laughs> Don't worry. Everything's gonna be fine. I'm right next door if you need me, okay? Hey, Jody, can you hear me? Okay, let's start. Kathleen is next door, and she has the same cards as you. And we're gonna get her to choose one and see if you can tell us which one she chose. You think you can do that? Good. All right, let's go for it. First card. Next card. Next card. Very good, Jody. Let's try something else. There's some building blocks on the table in the other room. You think you can make them fall over? I'm sorry, but I'm done. 
Okay, Jody needs the experimental. The door's locked! I'm no, telling Kathleen you, it's locked! No, it's not locked. Get me out of here! Give us a moment. Get me out of here now! Calm down, Kathleen. Go get the door. You have to stop now, Jody. The test is over. You need to stop. <laughs> It's over. It's over. It will never be over. What do I do if something goes wrong? There won't be anything you can do. That's what I suspected. Just checking. I feel like everyone's looking at us. That's not just a feeling. Everyone is looking at us. But the most important thing, act natural. If anyone speaks to you, just smile. So do you want me to act natural, or do you want me to smile? I didn't know you had a sense of humor. Only when I'm scared to death. Brian, I'm delighted you could attend. Always a pleasure, she come in. I uh, would like you to meet my assistant, Elizabeth. I was unaware that American diplomacy was undertaken with such disarming charm. The pleasure is mine, Elizabeth. Gentlemen, I give you back your host. We'll talk later on that. Until then, Ryan. He hates me. The whole time he was imagining my head on a stick. I think he found you charming. I should be flattered. Yeah, I'm gonna shake some hands, blend in, find some more quiet. You know what you have to do. Ah, Ambassador, you're a sight for sore eyes. I need to find a quiet place. كنت هناك في الشهر الماضي 
واشتا رايتو كل شيء من المتاجر الكبيرة وفي النهاية لم يكن هناك There's a large painting in one of the rooms upstairs. Behind it is a safe. The documents we're looking for are inside. But there are guards and cameras, so you have to be careful. You got it? It's like hell when you're too far away. An office with a portrait of the sheik. This is the place. There's got to be a switch somewhere. To move the painting. Find it, I didn't. حسام اذهب والقي نظرة على مكتب السفير حاضر ساذهب حالا Shit The camera was on oh, The curtain's coming Don't move anything or he'll sound the alarm أنا في المكتب كل شيء في مكانه I think there must be another way. This is the place. I don't know. You know what to do. Crap. You gotta distract the guard first. Yeah, heavy! Okay. Nobody will be able to monitor the main office now. We should be safe. Be careful, Aiden. You know you can't touch other people when you're controlling someone. It's not working. Get the guard out of here and open the safe. Go for it, Aiden. Now we have to. 
to read the documents. Make it quick. I can't hold on much longer. No, don't move. من أحد هناك الرجاء الخروج من هناك على الفور ولكن ماذا تفعل هنا إن هم رهد السيدات انصرف من هنا حسنا. أيها حسنا. المنحرف انصرف Listen, I'm not sure. Maybe I shouldn't go. Jody, you've been begging me for weeks. You're not gonna back up now. I don't know anybody there. They might all hate me and... Stress, stress is awful. Let's just go. Just take a deep breath. There's no reason to panic. It's just a birthday party. I'm sure everybody will like you. You'll have fun, maybe meet some new friends. Go on.
Oh, don't forget your present. It's a book of poetry by Poe. It's 50 years old and very rare. I'm sure she'll like it. Don't worry. It's gonna be all right. I'll pick you up at five. Have fun. Jody, come in. Hi. Hey, Kirsten, you come in? I gotta go. Come in, Jody. Don't be shy. Hey, Jody, right? Come on, we're in the living room. Some girls from my school and the least dorky guys we could find. Oh, is that a present for me? Cool. Thanks. I'm off, darling. Look after your friends and don't do anything stupid, all right? Sure, Mom, whatever you say. Oh, finally, she gets the hint. Hey everyone, this is Jody. She's in Unit 4 with my mom. Unit 4? The paranormal department? Ooh, what you do there? Bend spoons or speak to dead people? No. Stuff like that? No. Yeah, party time! I'll get the beer. Guys, do the shutters. Girls, do the candles. And Jody, you can take care of the music. Let's get crazy! Garbage is that. Slide over. Don't put on something from this century. Something really popping. Kirsten, you're a genius. Daddy, you want one? Yeah, cool, sure. <laughs> hey, don't choke on it. I bet it's your first time. No, I've had some before. <laughs> of course you have. First time, huh? They didn't get me that way, too. <coughs> Jody, you're acting kind of weird. It's a pale face. You sure you feel all right? You're not looking too hot, Jody. <laughs>
wondering why we're here. I'm thinking the same thing. I know, you told me. I just wanted to see what it would be like to go out and, and have friends. This is not what I expected. Jody, right? I've never seen you at school before. You don't take classes on bass? I'm in a different program with, with my own teacher. It's, it's kind of boring. <laughs> I, I, I never get to see people my age. I, I suppose I've gotten used to it. So you work with Kirsten's mother? I've never met Kirsten before. Her mom works in my unit, and that's why I was invited. I used to live in, in London before I moved here two years ago. And you? Where did you live before? New York. Man, I love New York, it's awesome. I went there once and it blew me away. Do you have any hobbies? Anything you do for like fun? I surf any chance I get and I play in a band with a bunch of friends. And you, what are you into? It's gonna sound really boring. I, I like to read and I like sports. <laughs> I mean, I, I can't, I can't leave the base, so it, it sort of limits things. Can I, can I ask you something? Why are you in Unit 4? I'd rather not talk about it. Sorry, damn, I'm so stupid. I, I hope I haven't, like, upset you or anything. No, that's okay. Oh. Slow dance. Are you, you up for it? I don't. I don't really know how. That's all right. I don't really know how to either. So. <laughs> special about you. Thanks. You don't really know me. <laughs> Thanks for the dance, Matt, but I, I think I'll pass. Jody give us a demonstration of her super mega powers. <laughs> no, <laughs> Great no, idea. no, I, I'd pay to see that. Ugh, forget it, it's just a little bull. Yeah, come on, Jody, show us what you can do. Okay, Jody, you up for demonstration? Oh. 
All right, then. So, what are you gonna do, Jody? Just be quiet and don't move. <laughs> oh, I'm scared already. I just want my pants. <laughs> Shut up, Steven. There. I saw something. Don't be stupid, Emma. There's nothing. I swear it. I felt something. It's like there, there was someone right <sighs> Freezing. What's happening? Man, what the hell was that? <laughs> the table! Look at the table! Okay, I've had enough. Yeah, me too. Uh, that that was really scary. I didn't mean to to frighten anyone. Sorry, I. You know, you guys insisted, and right. Okay, guys, it's time to eat that delicious cake, and most important, to open my birthday <sighs> gifts. Actually, the cake can wait. I'm opening my gifts first. Love, Jen. X X X. Oh, that's nice, babe. I bet it's knee socks. A thong! Just exactly what I needed! Now you can stop stealing your mom's. <laughs> and improve your chances of finding a decent boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> My future lover wants to thank you for making his life more interesting. What is that? An old book. It smells funky. It's a really rare collection. Uh, poems by Edgar Allan Poe. Edgar Allan who? What, did you steal this from your grandpa's library? No, no, and it's really rare. Yeah, just like your dress. <laughs> <laughs> no, but seriously, is this a joke? I can't believe you came all the way to my birthday party just to give me this old crap. And she thinks she's so clever. But she's just a little lab rat. A freaky little lab rat. Yeah. She's been following me around like a puppy all evening, begging for it. Oh, and she's a slut too. I never wanted to invite her, my mom made me. Yeah, she's a slut, a slut and a witch. We should like, do something to her. What do you do with witches? You burn them. <laughs> Get her! <laughs> <laughs> Your darkness. Let me go! Bring forth your mighty power. <laughs> please, please let me Once out! The first moment I saw I'm her. begging you, please <laughs> let me out! Please! Did someone say cake? Please, no, I want to get out! Please, I want to get out! I'm begging yeah, you, please let start. me out!
done. Very funny, Steven. Hey, it wasn't me. I didn't do it this time. <laughs> Shit, that's crazy. I'm getting out of here. Don't leave me alone. Okay, wait for me. <laughs> The door, it won't open. It's impossible, try harder. I'm telling you, it's locked. Keep calm, there's, there's no reason to panic. <laughs> the windows, try the windows. They're locked. Guys, this is a joke. It's really <laughs> <not funny. laughs> what was that? What the fuck is going on? Help! Help! Watch out! Help! 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 We gotta get out of here! So cut it out! He's replacing Dr. Matthews. He's the one who's gonna be taking care of me from now on. He seems really nice. Go on, he wants to meet you. Go on, hurry up. I'll be right here, sweetheart. Hello, Jody. Come in. My name is Nathan. Nathan Dawkins. I thought it would be a good idea for us to have a little chat, get to know each other a little better. That is, if it's okay with you, of course. Jody, my job is to study strange events and then try to explain them. Like the things that happen around you, right, Jody? Your mother tells me you have an invisible friend.
This friend, has he been with you a long time? Since you were born? Is he a ghost? Or a spirit of someone who passed away? Can you draw him from me? And if I take a look? So, this thing is your friend, and he's connected to you with some kind of cord. Is he here right now? Can you tell him to do something? You tell him what to do, and it happens. I don't tell Adam what to do. No one does. He's like a lion in a cage. We're tied together. He can't go away. That makes him really angry. It's not my fault. I want him to leave, too. It can be really scary sometimes. Did, did he do that to you? No. That was the monsters. your room. This is where you'll study and sleep for the next three years. The training starts tomorrow at 5 a.m. Don't be late. Come on, Holmes. Keep up. your grip. Use your momentum to swing across. Hurry! That's it, Holmes. Come on! I haven't got all day!
start again. That's the next cover. Got it? Excellent, Jody. Okay, recruit. Now get rid of those oil drums. Sunday stroll!
Not bad. Not bad, Jody. If this wasn't an exercise, you'd be dead by now. If this wasn't an exercise, you wouldn't even be able to open your big mouth, Ryan. <laughs> Congratulations, Operative Holmes. You made it. Welcome to the agency. Thank you, sir. Yeah, Jody. Welcome to the agency. Looks like you Great made job, it, Jody. Congratulations. Congratulations.